following cabinet decision to establish 19 service Uganda centers in the traditional cadastro zones, Ministry of Public Service is spearheading the establishment of a one-stop center Access in traditional cadastro zones to extend government services closer to citizens. The, the concept about Uganda service centers is to extend services closer to the people. So it's not a duplication or a repetition of already of services, but the already existing services are extended in terms of coverage and even numerical numbers so that we can reach more of the citizens. And uh, all this is to bring services in one room or under one roof so that uh, the citizens in the different locations or the different regions are able to partake of those services. The national broadcaster UBC TV is mandated to sensitize citizens about services offered by Service Uganda centers. The issue about sensitization and promotion of this concept is being advanced very well by UBC. We sensitize the different uh, stakeholders who include majorly the citizens and even the service providers. About one, the level of services that they should expect from us. And we also interface with them to hear from them the level of services that they expect from us. So UBC becomes very handy in terms of letting the population know what, what they should expect at the centers. Bureaucracy at government ministries was noted as a challenge that lags the development of government programs. we have decided about that is strengthening two things we have agreed upon one strengthening the champions in terms of knowledge and training and two updating the champions to both technical and political levels and this meeting has decided that also the prime minister which is uh, responsible for technical and also political coordination this is a constitutional mandate that it has this meeting has decided and agreed that we engage further with also the Prime Minister. Kasese, Hoima are operational. However, over 19 service Uganda centers in traditional cadastral zones of Karamoja, Jinja, Iganga, Soroti, Gulu, Fort Potro, Mbarara, Masaka, among others, are expected to be established soon. Irene Faith Nantongo, Mary Namukose, UBC News.